Hello there, CCIV and Lucid Motors have, well, they've, they've pretty much said the merger is happening. So brilliant, absolute confirmation on that point. So you'd think, oh, the stock price would go up, eh? Eh? No, it's gone from, where are we? <laughs> it's gone from 58 to 34. Hmm, how fun. Is there anything to worry about? Well, if you were buying in at the 54s and so on, and if you were day trading it, probably. You know, you're probably in a lot of uh, loss at the moment. If you're thinking long term, a few four years, five years down the line, is there anything to worry about? Probably not. You know, as long as the company does well, probably not. Uh, you know, luckily, I sold out my shares at a good profit and so on. So I'm going to be looking. I mean, if I had the funds available, I'd have put some in at the 30 range. I'm going to be sort of. I'm going to be keeping an eye on this one. We have had ridiculous, absolute ridiculous movements. If we look at the one day chart, that doesn't help. <laughs> four hour chart all right so if we look at the four hour chart we've pretty much sort of when we were in that 35 range stupidly jumped up to like the 58 there must have been like insider investing or so on or big corporations investing uh dropping down to that 32 mark we currently see ourselves at rsi is now starting to correct going from all the highs into about fair value as of talking Again, we are now given that confirmation. If you were in it to be part of Lucid Motors, you're you're laughing. You're currently, you know, you got the merger right. Well done to you. If you are day trading, I won't even mess around. In my opinion, I won't even mess around with it. It's going to be too hard to predict. We're currently in a bearish market as of today, anyway. My light's gone off. I'm dark now. Uh, so all these companies are probably at a bit of a steal right now. Or if we were overpriced before, maybe we're at now the actual price. Depends how you look at it. You know, people could say that we were overpriced in pretty much all of them. In certain things, I believe we were. I believe we were overpriced on these. So we could be at a fair value. Currently, they're not making any sales. So it's probably technically still overpriced. If But in like future growth, it could be fine. Uh, that's all up to you to really do your own due diligence. But CCIV have confirmed it. So that is really good news. I want to know if you were in them for the Lucid Motors or if you were in them for the hype and just to quickly cash in and cash out. Uh, let me know in the comment section do you currently have shares are you holding your shares you're going to keep them i am looking for opportunities to potentially buy in uh i should have bought in at the 30 when i saw it near there really the 31 32 uh 33 i don't kind of remember what it was um i'm probably not going to buy in anymore i'm just going to let everything settle down i've bought in on me ideonomics more on them and more on lordstown motors workhorse called it people i called it they've gone down to 25 uh not buying in not going to buy in. I don't have the funds available and I'm not selling out on ridiculous losses to buy in on like a workhorse or anyone. So just know that you're, if your portfolio is in a complete red at the moment, so is mine. Don't worry, I'm down a lot of money. It's just the way the cookie crumbles at the moment. If you sell out, you've lost the money. If you don't, you're not. All right, just think of it like that. Before I go, I have to now start stating at every video that I am not a professional people. More people are starting to watch my videos, which is amazing. But I always want people to remember, I'm not offering advice. I'm merely talking about something I enjoy. Uh, merely want a discussion with you guys and gals out there to hit me in the comment section. Let me know if I'm right, wrong. Your opinions, if you've got shares. It's literally, this channel is a place for discussion and not advice. Uh, so please remember that. Do your own due diligence. Anyway, I'm going to leave you to it. Like I said, let me know in the comments any good stuff. Peace out, people. Have a good one. And let's ride the storm together. Bye.